From parking and transit to the biopark and Sunport, the city has lost money left and right during the pandemic. But one revenue stream is doing better than it did before the virus arrived. Here's News 13's Francesca Washington. Golfers filled the Dare Golf Course for the first round of the city's men's championship. Course director Bill Harvey says it's not just special events that keep them busy. Over the past few months, they've seen a steady wave of golfers hitting the greens. We're taking tee times at 5.30 right now, 5.45 for nine holes. Uh, very unusual. Our practice area has been flooded uh, daily. With entertainment venues shut down because of the public health order. There's probably not a lot else to do uh, during this pandemic. And but I, you know, I'm glad to see the golfers come out and it's clear the city's golf courses are seeing more now during the pandemic than they did last year back in the days of normalcy. Yeah, the floodgates opened. Uh, people wanted to get out the activity uh, bug and everybody um, was overwhelming. So people wanted to get out and do things. According to Parks and Rec in May and June of this year, the city's four courses saw more than 61,000 rounds of golf, bringing in more than a million dollars. That's 40% busier than the courses were in May and June of last year, and an extra few hundred thousand dollars in revenue. There was just a lot more people playing, which I think is great. And it's not slowing down anytime soon. Golf is part of the easiest of the uh, activities that you can do to uh, be social, socially distanced. Francesca Washington, Care QE News 13. Albuquerque's golf courses were shut down for more than a month before they reopened in May. The extra revenue will make up for that lost month.